My name is Valerie Sullivan Fox, and I am a digital, I guess, new media artist. And my project was um, The Flood, and it's based on, it was inspired by the 1937 flood uh, that, that flooded the Ohio River Valley and really devastated the area for um, 37 days. My site was the YMCA down at New Albany, and um, it was a video projection installation. And what it came from was um, the 1937 flood, like I said earlier, the Ohio River Valley being flooded. And I, I just was looking at that building, and I noticed the coping on the building comes around. So I did a little research, and it turned out that coping was just right about the 10 feet there. It was like that height. I thought, wow, if we projected the video and kind of watched the whole flood kind of come up and down. The first six minutes of the projection is the flood water rising. It just rises up. It goes up to that 10-foot height. And then it'll stay there for like 23 minutes, and then it goes back out in eight minutes. And that's basically how the flood of 37 happened. Uh, the first six days, it rained straight. I mean, just heavy downpours. Um, and then it stayed up for 23 days, and then it flooded back out for eight. You know, it's interesting, it was 37 days, and it was 1937. I also have a personal connection with the river and the flood, because my grandfather was a riverboat captain, and he was always in love with the river. He was a uh, the pilot who sh what was called shooting the falls. He could he was like the only one who could take riverboats. So they would stop. He would get on the boats on the the boats that pushed the barges, and he would take them through the falls. Um, but he also uh, the National Guard had had basically made my grandfather continue the river traffic during the flood and he had to go help save people too. So he was away from his own home, which was flooded in West Louisville. <laughs> and, uh, you know, for seven days, they didn't know quite where he was <laughs> either. And so it was a real kind of direct connection to me, the river and the flooding. And it, it was actually one of the most rewarding projects I've ever done because I, we, I've got such a good reaction to the piece and the, uh, so many people saw it and would talk to me about it, or there were so many articles about it. I was really kind of, I mean, and people played in it, and they brought their kids, and they talked, you know, they experienced it. Um, the community did. That was, you know, it's funny. The hardest things turn out, turn out to be, like, the best, um, and that's certainly the case with this project especially with a public art project, it's so wonderful to see people downtown at night. Um, and that, that's the change I've noticed. It's bringing people back here, back to kind of our roots, um, back to, well, at least my roots, of being here as a child and seeing a more active place. And, I, and then, and then it's, it's such a joy to see people excited to walk around from public art project to public art project. I think it's creating a whole new identity for New Albany.